It's important for businesses to be able to identify and support vulnerable consumers so they can get the goods, services or support suitable to their needs. In a business context, consumer vulnerability refers to any situation in which an individual is unable to engage fully or effectively in a market. As a result, they lose out and could be exploited. Vulnerability is fluid and dynamic, and people can move in and out of periods of being vulnerable. It can be split into two broad categories. In the first, vulnerability may be a result of the consumer's personal circumstances, the timing and nature of the purchase, their level of knowledge or ability, or the effectiveness of the tools available to them to help them make a decision. The second type of vulnerability is caused by the market context. For example, a consumer may have to choose between complex offers or alternatives, or make decisions based on unclear information. They may also be unfamiliar with the market. Businesses can help vulnerable consumers by thinking about communication and design, not making assumptions, empathising with a consumer, asking questions in different ways, summarising what has been agreed in plain English, implementing a vulnerable consumer's policy. More information on identifying consumer vulnerability is available for free from Business Companion. www.businesscompanion.info is a government-backed website written by trading standards experts to help you understand the laws that affect your business. It's completely free and you can be sure that the information is up to date even when there is a change in the law. www.businesscompanion.info Trading Standards Law Explained